This is what we have when we have bending about the x-axis and in this case it's actually negative bending. Negative bending means the top flange is actually going to be in tension so it feels those tensile stresses in the top flange and the bottom of the flange, the bottom flange is going to feel the compression, the compressive stresses developed due to bending. In this case, we call this positive bending. And positive bending means that the top flange is going to be in compression and the bottom flange is going to be in tension. How about bending about the y-axis? In this case, we have bending about the y-axis and we know in this one that we have tension on the right side of the beam and we have compression acting on the left side of the beam. 